Good evening, everybody. You're watching What's New LA, and we're here finally at the annual Jewish Film Festival. Hi. Hi, Hilary. Good to see you. Thank you for coming so, to the 14th. Of course. Los Angeles. Jewish <laughs> 14 festival. years, guys. 10 years I'm following you with this microphone. Yeah. This yes. particular one. Oh, boy. <laughs> so, what's going to be unique this year. You have an Oscar winner here. We have an Oscar winner tonight. We're showing the film Skin by the Israeli director. This is his uh, feature debut um, for an American film. He's made, his name is Guy Nativ. He won the Oscar for the short film Skin. And this film is called Skin. It's, uh, was, it will be released in July. It stars Jamie feature. Bell. It's a feature length. It, it's also about a white supremacist, although the story is a little bit different. Some of the actors are the same. It's a different story, um, but it's a brilliant film. And it stars Jamie Bell of Billy Elliot fame. And you, you're watching the film and you're going, who is this? Who is this? And all of a sudden it occurs to you, oh my God, he's, it's like a, another Oscar written all over it. It's amazing. So we're so excited to have this film in a... a a preview, uh, you know, a, a yes, sneak preview, they, really. Um, exactly, they just came from Tribeca in yeah, New York. Yeah, it's been picked up by, you know, A24 is a huge distributor, so um, we're really thrilled to have it with our festival, and at the end of the film we're going to have a Q&A with, with Guy Nativ and his wife, who's his producer, Jamie Ray Newman. Amazing couple, yeah. and uh, we're not going to confuse you guys, there is a short skin that won an Oscar, and tonight we're going to watch a feature film with the same name. By the same director. <laughs> Same director, right? Yes. So some people were going to be... But you can, anybody can Google the short film now and see it um, and get a taste of that. This one is based on a true story. Um, uh, the character is Brian Widner. Anyway, they, anybody can Google it and read about it. But it's, uh, it's got the same name, but it's still about white supremacist and um, his journey and what happens. So it's an amazing film. Same name, different story. Um, for the last 14 years that you run in this film festival, did, happen, did something happen to you that it was unusual that you want to talk about? I just think that every year is something different and it's been growing each year. There's always a challenge to find you know, the best and the newest and to bring out a new audience and to engage in a dialogue with, with different people. I mean, the thing about this film is there's nothing Jewish about it at all. There's not, there's not even the mention of the word Jew in it. Just the director. <laughs> the director is Jewish, but that's not what we do. But what's important about this film is that it's absolutely relevant today. I mean, we had a, a shooting a week and a half ago Amazing. by a white supremacist of a synagogue in San Diego and, and hurt people and killed a woman. So, you know, this is going on. This is what's happening in our life now. And it's very much part of the Jewish narrative. And that's why it's important to show it. A few days ago, I watched a movie uh, called Hotel Mumbai. It's the oh, same yeah. thing. Yeah. It's it's like, and, I know and, that, yeah. and in this case as well, it's a Chabad uh, rabbi and his wife that got shot. As yeah, well. we actually had a short film that we were going to show, a documentary that was um, based on the st uh, the story, um, more focused on the founders of that Chabad, and we'll show it next year. They weren't finished with it. Yes. But it's exactly the same kind of thing that's going on. We're going to be here next year, but for yes. this but year, for now. yeah, we want to invite you guys to uh, go ahead and go to the website, watch all the list of the films. We and also, yes, I mean, this week kind of, uh, it falls in between Yam HaShoah and Yam, um, Yam HaZikaron and Yam HaTzmaot. And our closing night is Golda's Balcony the story of Golda Meir on Yom Hatzmaut with Tova Feldsha playing the role that she um, uh, created on Broadway and she will be here in person. That's going to so be amazing. I love yeah. those films about Golda Meir, not because she was the first uh, prime minister uh, woman in Israel. Uh, also Ingrid Bergman was playing Golda Meir. And this is, was a last part before she passed away. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, it's amazing. So you guys invited. How many more days? We have now through Thursday, May 9th. Thank you very much, Hilary. Good luck. Do you want our website? Of course. Ah, uh, our Go website. Ahead. I didn't want well, you have anyone. our Facebook page is Los Angeles Jewish Film Festival. Our website is lajfilmfest.org. Buy tickets because that's going to be amazing film festivals. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Good night. <laughs>